Hi, I'm Rabbi Michael Barclay here at Temple Ner Simcha in Westlake Village, California, with another tour insight into this week's portion of Shmini, and also to wish you a Chag Sameach, a happy Passover. I hope everyone's really enjoying your Pesach time. This week's Torah portion of Shemini goes into a lot of different practices that we use, but there's an interesting concept that we can find in the very beginning of the portion that extends through the whole thing. It's about how do we dedicate a sacred space? How do we inaugurate a sacred space? How do we take a room that's just a room and make it so it's consciously holy for us? Since everything is naturally holy because it's created by God, how do we make it so that we can appreciate its holiness? And there's all these passages and teachings that come from the Torah portion this week, but I want to recommend the entire concept of sacred space to you. Take a little piece in your house and build an ark, a temple, a sanctuary. I don't mean a physical ark, a physical temple, or physical sanctuary. But whether it's a corner or whether it's a prayer room, a space that you can go to, to just meditate, breathe, to be conscious of God's magnificence in your life, to pause when you're angry to calm down and realize under the sad, anger is sadness and under the sadness can be wisdom, to pause when you're out of control and the world around you seems so chaotic, a place that is yours. Decorate it with the things that make you feel special, make you feel holy. Everything's holy, but we need those triggers to help us realize it a lot of the time. You don't necessarily need incense, but if you want some, have some. You don't necessarily have to have holy books, but if you want some, have some. But create a space that is only used by you, for you, or with your family, that you can make holy, that you can really enjoy life and appreciate God from. Let us all find these holy spaces. Let us create them. And then this holiday of Passover extends through the whole year in terms of our appreciation of God, God's miracles, God's graciousness, and freedom. Chag Sameach and Shabbat Shalom. I'm Rabbi Michael Barclay here at Temple near Simcha in Westlake Village.